So I will now be showing you what I have purchased during this trip. Um, I will be showing you the shoes, the bags and the makeup pockets that I have purchased but I will also be showing you the makeup that I have got from Kiko Milano. Um, this brand is a makeup brand that I have been using for quite some time now and I'm happy with it. Um, they have various products that are good for people with oily skin like me and the presentation, the packaging and also the quality of the products is very good. Um, I will be including the link in the description box down below the video. This is not a sponsored video. I'm saying this just because I really like their products and as usual I like sharing with you my opinions. But um, I did purchase a lot of makeup from Kiko. I think it's the first things that I have purchased as soon as I arrived in Taormina. So um, I'm very happy with them. So let's get into what I have purchased. I have these makeup pockets. This is the first one and it is from Kiko. It's the large size of this pocket. Um, I think I will be using it um, as an essentials pouch probably. So you will be seeing it in some of my what's in my bags video for sure. Um, it's a very spacious pocket. I did have all the makeup before this filming um, into it and it stayed perfectly. I think it's also very easily to wash um, and there are another two or three sizes smaller than this one. I obviously got the large one because I need to carry things in my bag. I think you know about that. But anyways, um, it's also very lightweight so it's very good for me and my things, the things that I carry in my bag. I also have these two uh, mesh sort of makeup bags. They are very slim. Um, they are easily washable also and they still have a very spacious area inside. Um, they come one inside each the other and there is the largest one and yes they also come from Kiko. You can see the brand over there. Now let's go on to the shoes. I have purchased these uh, this pair of shoes, they are so beautiful. These are all rhinestones as you can see there. Um, they are very, very comfortable. Both pair of shoes that you are seeing here um, are very comfortable. I have already used them during the trip. Obviously, I did clean the shoes before putting them here for you to see in the clip. But um, I did walk a lot um, during the sightseeing and I have used them both. They are very, very comfortable. I don't know the brand. Um, here there is hot sand, you can see it there. And this one here, it has sort of a squishy sole here and it's rose gold, it's very soft. You can see it here and it says, Vera Pelle, so it is um, real leather. I got both of them on sale. I think this, the brand is J Day, I think, and it's made in Italy. So yes, those are the shoes that I have purchased. I'm gonna show you the bags. Um, let me just put a little bit these aside so I can bring forward the bags. Both bags that I have purchased were also on sale and they were um, from Tosca Blue. You can see it on the dust bag here. Um, I bought one in pink and one in black. So let me focus a bit for you. You can see here that it comes with sort of a tassel and this sort of keychain or decorative thing here it says Tosca blue and this pink matches completely the lining of the bag I really hope that it will continue to focus yes it is so the bag is very very spacious on the base you can see it has a very very large base it reminds me of the Louis Vuitton um, never fall um, because it seems a very uh, very similar to the base those bags have. It's a tote bag. It does not have a zip that closes the bag, but it comes with two bags. This is the first one, which closes with a zip. And then on the other side, it also has another one. So as you can see, it has two zipper pockets over there. 
that's another one the lining inside of the bag is pink but the bag is actually black and that's a very very beautiful bag um, let me just try to show you a bit better so as you can see it's a beautiful black bag and it comes with two straps but also had another um, very long strap that I don't know where I've put but you can attach it on the sides because there are D rings on the sides and you can just um, attach the long strap to it but yes these are very good for office um, also for out and about but I'm sure that you will be seeing this bag um, during one of the what's in my bags video in the coming months because I really want to start using it it's very spacious and will probably fit me so yes you will see it now the next bag that I want to show you is another one which is that fell off <laughs> which is a pink bag you can see the dust bag over there this bag I have been using it all throughout the trip um, since the moment I have purchased it I just started putting everything into it and I went out and about with it because it's very very spacious it's a very light um, pink it has a Tosca blue here you can see and it comes okay this shows better and it comes with two very long straps as you can see there um, as I said I was going out and about with this bag on my shoulders and it really fit me a lot um, here there is the inside of this bag you can see it has another pocket which is a silver pocket you can take out and this is the inside of the bag it's also a very spacious bag as you can see there so you have to be very careful with these bags however because um, I was very very afraid that the colors from my clothes would rub on the bag but it did not happen but I was very afraid of that um, I kept cleaning it all the time as I said it has this beautiful decoration on the front which is sort of an embossed flower um, and this bag was available in white for sure I'm not sure whether there was black but both of the bags were on sale um, this bag comes with this other bag inside which you can attach also a strap to it and use it like this so really and truly it's sort of a two-in-one bag um, and here oh here are the straps I managed to find the straps this is the strap to the silver bag to this one and this is the strap to the other bag that I have shown you earlier but this is the strap for the silver one so as you can see you can have also another bag so in total I can say that I have got three bags because there's the silver one there's this pink one and there's the black one that I have shown you earlier which is this one here so basically I have got three bags two pair of shoes um, three makeup pockets and all the makeup that I will be showing you so I really did a lot of shopping but anyways we'll go on to the makeup that I have purchased so as I promised I am sharing with you the makeup that I have purchased during our trip all the makeup that you are seeing here is from Kiko Milano and I have purchased all this with my own money so this is not a sponsored clip not at all um, but I really like Kiko. I have been using this brand for quite some time now and I have some things which are repurchases like these eyeshadows here but I have also purchased uh, new things like these products um, and the powders. Um, the lipsticks are also repurchases. Um, they are my favorite colors and while I was there I just decided to get um, some more of them so let's get into it and I will be uh, going through each and every product and share with you what I have got so the first thing that I wanted to show you is this uh, face makeup fixer this spray sometimes I did uh, spray it before I do my makeup do my makeup and then um, spray it again just to fix everything I have very very greasy oily skin so I really try always to find new tricks and tips um, on what I can use what how I can use it um, to just help me for me it's a problem because I get 
um, a very very shiny nose and my cheeks also um, start to shine a lot and after two or three hours that I have applied my makeup I always end up having to retouch it and there have been also instances where I had to redo my makeup completely um, especially in summer when it's hot weather is even more difficult for me to keep up with my makeup um, so I'm always trying to find new products um, so I can try them out and I will be sharing my experience with you eventually um, of whatever um, I will be repurchasing. There will be future videos um, where I will be discussing things that I will be repurchasing and others that I will not be um, purchasing again. So these are my four favorite lipsticks from Kiko. Um, I have decided to go on and repurchase them. I have two of the same colors, which are these ones. The presentation of the Kiko makeup is just fantastic. And this is the 204, hope it focuses. It's the Glossy Dream lipstick. And I'm gonna show you how it is. So that's the color, it's a glittery. Uh, type of color um, yeah look at how beautiful it is um, it's a dark sort of a dark pink I love dark pink lipsticks um, this is also another one and this is in the number it has it's in the number 508 and this is the color you can see it there and then I purchased also a bit of a darker shade. Let me just close this up. A darker shade, which is this one here, the 131 Gossamer Emotion. Okay. And this is the color. I did use this already while I was on the trip because I couldn't resist I just had to try it out this is a bit of a dark color and it's also a matte color so those are the lipsticks um, this is a cream a bright lift matte um, mattifying and lifting effect day cream with SPF 15 I was told that I can use this uh, type of uh, day cream before I do apply my makeup um, and it should help me just with the uh, keeping up with the mattifying effect for my makeup too during the day for the oily skin. And then I have also purchased this Shine Refine Day. It's a sebum balancing gel cream and this can also be used before you apply your makeup. Um, I believe that both these types of creams can be also applied before you go to bed even though they are night creams. Um, I think that you can still apply them. Now, two mascaras that I have purchased. The first one is a Luxurious Lashes Extra Volume Brush Mascara. And this is the brush. I did purchase this mascara because I really, really liked the brush. Um, and just one trick. If you like a mascara brush and not that much the mascara, you can just clean the brush and use it with other mascaras too. This is something which I like to uh, to do sometimes. So yeah, the brush is the first thing that I really liked about this. And then there is a treatment for your lashes, which is a Pro Gel Mascara. I hope you can see it. And it's a transparent mascara see it there um, you can apply it before you go to bed um, so it will um, basically help you dur during the night I did purchase also the skin trainer CC blur which is a perfect skin optical corrector it's a primer for your skin before you go on and you apply your makeup so yeah it's a neutral color and I was told it's very very good for oily skin too now let's go oh this is an eyebrow pencil precision eyebrow pencil in the number 06 and here is the pencil tip while well, this is the brush tip 
what else now let's go on to the eyeshadows which are these four single ones and then i have this which is a quartet um you can see the package is wonderful this is the number 02 which is a bright quartet let me open and show you this is the four colors they are very glittery colors then I've got these colors here, which is, one is a purplish, all of them are very glittery. This is the number 65, and it's a purpley, glittery type of eyeshadow. This is sort of a neutral beige type, and it's in the number 32. It's also very, very glittery can see it there this is a whitish one but it's also very glittery and that's in the number 83 and this is the pinkish glittery eyeshadow in the number 60 so those are the eyeshadows I have purchased I have also purchased this 232 Hopefully you see it. Yes, 232 Long Lasting Wet and Dry Use Eyeshadow. And I'm going to open it for you. It's a silvery type of eyeshadow. Very, very beautiful. And I have already tried it out on my skin. You can see I have some glittery. But let me just put again a bit of it that's on my finger. And if you put it, you can see how glittery it is. So those are the eyeshadows. I have purchased also two foundations which are this matte mousse oil free foundation which has SPF 15 and they are both the same colors. They are 03 natural rose. Um, I have not yet tried these out but I purchased two because um, in the shop there were products which were opened and you could try them out and when I tried a little bit a sort of a test patch on my face of that color it was beautiful so this is why I went for two now let's go for the pressed powders one pressed foundation and one blush and I'm gonna open the blush for you this is the number 04 um, which is a shade fusion trio blush let me just show you the colors. They are very, very beautiful colors. That's the pink over there. They are trios. Then I've got, this is uh, a pressed powder. And let me just open it up for you. That's the color. And then I've got one and this is the color then there is another one which is this is quite different because it's the WR50 and it's a wet and dry powder foundation let me open it for you and this is the color and the last one is uh, the O2 Press Powder 2. And that's the color. So this is basically all I have purchased from Kika. Um, all the makeup that I have purchased. I was very happy with my purchases. There were a bunch of discounts so I could also be using them. Um, but I will be including the website uh, link in the description box down below the video if you just have liked this makeup. You can purchase online. They do also, I believe, international shipping. So you can um, purchase makeup from this brand and just try them out. I don't know. Um, but I really like them. I usually get my makeup um, from the website. But since I was in the shop, um, I could just try out also a bunch of new things that they had. Um, as I said, this is not a sponsored video, it's just uh, the products that I have purchased. But I really hope that you have liked um, all the things that I have shown you. Until the next video, 